Oh, here we go. Pack of cigarettes. Ooh, another one. Ow! I found out what killed the raiders! Oh my fucking jeez! Oh, there's another one! Yo, dog meets a fucking boss, bro! Oh my! We need to open this place up. Oh, dog meat, you're a freaking G. Walked up in there, bit him on his butt cheek, and called it a day. What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome back to episode number eight of the Fallout 3 campaign. We are going to, I think we're going to head out. I need my microphone to my face. How about that? We do anything. We got to go to Vault 112. That is the uh, main objective for today, uh, which is way the fuck out here, huh? Okay, well, I guess we'll go to Megaton. 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 And to go that way. I'm pretty sure we already sold a bunch of stuff, so we should be good there. And I also want to try something before we actually head out. You go around this way. I think this will work. I'm not 100% sure, but we're gonna we're gonna find out. Do 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 do. Also, if you guys are new, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, share your with your friends. You know the drill. Do the YouTube stuff. Come on here, mole rat. I know you're out here. Come on. One more time. Yep. There's no need. Could've left me alone, but you didn't, did you? Found it. It's right here. <laughs> oh, man. I knew it was back here. I just, had to, I just had to find it. Okay. Why is there so many of these freaking things? Okay. Yep. Yep. I need to turn this shit down. I'm gonna tell you that. Now we can head out. I knew that there was a, a, a hollowed out rock. I just had to find it. I thought it was on the other side, but that's okay. Alright, maybe it just doesn't, you know, come through until you go to the left or right side. I'm not sure. Left side, right side, whatever the hell it is. Maybe it doesn't spawn in or something. I don't know. Ah, why is there... Yeah. Come on now. Okay. Where's my dog at? Dog meat. Where are you at? Are you here? I'm not really getting too concerned, so if he dies or anything like that, I'm just gonna keep it moving. I'm not gonna, like, reload or anything. I'm just really not. Also, if you guys are enjoying this, let me know in the comments, because, uh... I'm really thinking about doing, like, a Fallout New Vegas and, like, maybe like a Fallout 4 playthrough as well, so... Uh, maybe an Elder Scrolls. You know, I'm not sure. We'll we'll figure some stuff out. I, I like to have these, these, these types of games on the channel just as a continuation, like a continued uh, series, because it allows me to be a he get ahead videos. If that makes sense. Because this, I can you know, I can I can record five or six in a day, and then that's six videos uh, or six days worth of shit, and then obviously anything else we're playing at the time as well. So. It just makes it easier. Right. How that uh, you don't like that? Right in your head. Oh, now there's, there's dog meat. Oh my god, this condition is terrible. We gotta get a better one. I don't wanna, I don't wanna break it. <clears throat> um, let's do... Uh, let's do this one. We haven't used this in a while. It's not a lot of, uh... It's really not a lot, damage-wise, but we'll use it anyway. There should be one more, right? Or am I... Yeah, there's three right here. Okay, and we're gonna pick these Iguana Bites. And we're gonna eat these. Actually, we'll take this water as well. Okay, continue on. I guess we could go check out that stuff, but I think we're going to stick with the main quest for right now. Just try to get this done. I would like to do this entire game in like 20, 20 parts or so. Maybe a little less, maybe a little more. Not sure yet how exactly I want to go about it. Nice.
one now. Got his ass. Nice. Wait, we actually got a sniper rifle. Hold on. Go ahead and get some of these uh, things down here. Sniper rifles. Perfect. Alright. Vicious dogs again? Really? A lot of dogs out here, isn't there? Come on, dog meat, do your thing. You're a dog. Handle it. Doing well. Nice. Nice. Alright, let's continue. Uh, looks like there's like a ruined house over there. I want to explore more, but... I also want to try to get this mission done. This main mission. Random shacks out here. We'll, we'll hit this on the way out. We'll loot that over there as well. Maybe able to get some good stuff. Cups. Empty, of course it is. Uh, nothing too crazy in here. That's all right. Rad scorpions. Hit the button. Nice. Got it? Man, Doug needs a freaking champ, dude. My god. Freaking champ, if I've ever seen one. What is over here? More dog? Oh, these are mole rats. Stop it. Enough. Handle it. There more? Perfect. We'll sleep an hour. I'll let us get our uh, stuff back, so. Keep it moving, you know what I'm saying? I don't think there's gonna be anything in this wreckage, though. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. That bed was clutch, so we'll take that, but other than that, we'll just keep it moving. Looks like there's a church over there. Okay. Well. How far away are, are we away from the place? Just a little bit ahead yet? I can't wait to freaking start uh, exploring these areas. Location up here. I wonder if it's over beyond this place or how far away it is. I bet it's that right there. Guarantee it is. Oh, we got two of them actually. Wait, is this? I'm gonna put this together. I wonder if this is. We keep following this. I wonder if we'll find the, uh... uh my, what am I thinking of? The alien blaster. Still got a little bit of ways to go yet to get to this place, so... We'll loot this little area and then we'll head out. God dang it. Ooh, a nuke. Let's go. We're gonna need that just in case. Surgical is empty. That's empty. Paint guns. Oh, here we go. Pack of cigarettes. Ooh, another one. Ow! 
I found out what killed the raiders. Oh my fucking jeez. Yalguai. Is there another one? <gasps> there is. It's inside. Yo, I hate Yalguai, bro. They're, uh, they're not cool. He's looking up this way. What do you see, boy? Oh, there's another one. Look at a pack of Yagwai over here, bro. Just chilling. Oh my gosh. Okay, we gotta try to get this one out. I'm gonna freaking hit this thing from the distance here. Thing about this gun though, it doesn't really do a lot of damage. Oh, there's another one! Yo, dog meets a fucking boss, bro! Oh my! We need to open this place up. He's almost dead, actually. It would be alright. Oh, dog meat, you're a freaking G. Walked up in there, bit him on his butt cheek, and called it a day. That dog's a beast. Oh my Jesus. Alright, be careful with the rads, oh my. My gosh. Anything else we can get in here? I don't think so. I'm not giving you a hug. Relax. Never did it before, so why do you think today was the day? Alright, let's go ahead and head out. Dog meat, you good? Come on. Come on, boy. We got places to be, things to get. Is it above us? I don't know. I'm not going to deal with it until because of the problem. It's a good way to look at life. <laughs> oh, it's one of these things. Let's get on this rock for a little advantage. These things do not do a lot of damage, man. Look at that. No, dog meat's a beast. Okay, one more time to kill him. Freaking wow, man. What's your, uh... God, I wish I had, like, a... Like an always, like an indicator is what I should say, of how much health he has without having to look at him while he's in fighting. There probably is a way to do that, I just don't know how to do it if there is. That's alright though, we'll keep rocking. I'm gonna go up this way. We should be coming up on... The, uh, Vault 112. Here soon. Should be just be over this bridge, I would, I would assume. Frickin' Deathclaw. Mm, no thanks. Not dealing with that today, please. Okay? Just not, is the thing. Those things are scary. Okay, it's just one of those rat scorpions. Just making sure it wasn't a freaking uh, death claw, because I just don't want to have to deal with it, you know. Okay. God, I wish I could run, man. It's one thing I loved about Fall Four: you can be able to run by anything or anywhere at any given time, as long as you had the AP. Okay, just a mole rat. Gonna cut through here and not even deal with him. To be honest with you. Watch the rads. Watch the rads, bro. Go just one. It's not bad. Okay, here we go. Looks like we're coming up on something here. A lot of mole rats in this area. Like a lot.
What is this place? Smith Casey's Garage? Hey, Death. Uh, not Death. Talk to me. Help me out here. We got Outcast, Outcast Robo Brain. Look at this place. Alright, let's go ahead and jump in. Let's go ahead and jump up in here, shall we? Open that. Got these Nuka Colas. Why not? Why the hell not, right? Hey, what is this? Is this actually food or is this just a can? Mm, I think it's just a can. Now, I'm pretty sure there's something significant about this Casey's Garage, right? Is this how you get into the vault? It is. That's what it is. That's what I remember. Excuse me. Is anybody here? Get on the table. Get on the table! Man, dumb town you dog me is a fucking beast in this game. Dude, I'm telling you, this gun is not- is so bad that it literally takes two shots to kill a freaking Red rat- a red roach. Words. Turn this light on. Okay. Make sure we can't loot anything while we're here. Uh... Take that quantum. Nothing interesting there. There we go. Tumblers today. Is that empty? Yeah. Just hitting a bunch of buttons, as you can see. Lunchbox. Okay. Nothing too crazy there. Hoping there's some scrap metal in here, because that'd be amazing. Definitely be worth it there. Motorcycle. I know, babe. Or dude. Babe. What did I say babe for? Alright, open this. Gun cabinet. Oh man, I was hoping I could get a shotgun. That'd be amazing. Could fix ours. Alright, should be good now. Nice. Alright. Go ahead and go down. Vault 12, a 1 12. Here we go. Just doing this to get the, uh, thumbnail just because I wanted to use this as a thumbnail as well so I gotta do this every time I want a thumbnail I gotta run in here push a bunch of buttons and then freaking plug my controller back in they're saying Johnny why don't you just play on the PC I don't know I just feel way more con I feel a lot more in control with the controller obviously but there's like some games I would rather play on a PC it's really weird I how I do things I guess I know it doesn't make any sense, but that's just how I is, okay? Just how I is. Alright, um... Nothing up here. I guess we'll just go ahead and go in. Go in a little bit deeper, shall we? Welcome to Vault 112, resident. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind <laughs> schedule. Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault Suit before proceeding. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized to distribute a new one. Once dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your assigned Tranquility Lounger. Oh, is this Tranquility Lane? And be seated. Oh, I hate this place. This is my least favorite part of this game, Tranquility Lane. Put it on a 112 suit. Uh, did I even get one? I did. Nice. Oh, God, I hate this place. 
Oh, can't stand it. It doesn't take long, but it's just one of those things. Yep, this is it. Oh. Oh my jeez. Yep, this is it. All right, here we go. Nice helmet, dude. <laughs> oh man. Oh god, I hate this. Watch the face that pops up. There it is. <laughs> oh man. I don't know why I don't like this place. I just I never have. I don't I don't know. Probably is waiting outside the vault 101. You got it. All right, we're gonna save it before we do anything because oh we got a level up. Nice. Okay, we're gonna do. We're gonna. Nah, I don't want to do repair. Let's do science. Thirty-five. We'll do repair to forty-five. We'll do lock pick up the rest. We'll continue with it. And we'll do scoundrel for the next perk. All right, let's go ahead and say that one more time since that's already done. Okay, Betty, I'm here. The reason why. Oh, someone new this, to play with. What good luck I have lately. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Um, I'm looking for my fault now. Let's see who and you are. I'm Betty. I live here on Tranquility Lane. Want to play a game? A game? No thanks. No game for me. Uh, what the hell's going on here? We're going to play a game now, silly. That's what's going on. A game? Okay, I guess. I knew you would. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbomb cry. Timmy Newsbomb? Who's that? He's the only other kid that lives here besides you. He's a big crybaby. You're a kid? You'll see. Make him cry, and then come back here so we can talk some more. Alright, so this is usually how I do this. I save it. Okay. Now, we can really... No, we don't even have... What can I do for you, sport? I wasn't even talking to you. Where am I? <laughs> Such a kidder. You're on Tranquility Lane, of course. Where else would you be? Um... I have to go. I wasn't even Take trying to talk to you in the first place. This is usually what we'll do. Okay, let's say that again, just in case we have to reload. We talked to this kid. Hi there, I'm Timmy. Wanna play? Now we gotta make him cry. Here's a speech thing. What? We, succe we succeeded. Did I do something it. bad? Um, I thought you should know. No, cool. no, not my mommy and daddy. No. All right, and then no, no. save again. This is just how I've always done it. I've played a lot, a lot of this. Uh, Tranquility Lane is my least favorite. You talk to her. Yay! I knew you could do it. Perhaps not. So I just want to show you that you know, approach, this isn't really what you think it is. Can be quite powerful. Well done. Nice. And for winning the game, you get a prize. You get to ask one question and receive an honest answer. Where's my father? Your father? Uh, he's a scientist looking for the Doctor Braun. What a splendid turn of events. I had no idea the two of you were related. Yes, I have indeed seen him. I'm afraid he's rather unavailable at the moment. What have you done to him? Were I you, I'd be more concerned with myself at the moment. And besides, we're done with questions for now. Perhaps we'll address it at a later time. First, I have something else for you to do. Okay. Hey? What do you want me to do? Pay a visit to the Rockwells. They're very happily married. And I'd like you to change that. Put an end to their marriage. And we'll talk. Okay. Uh, fine. It's not because I want answers from you. Rationalize it any way you'd like. If you succeed, we'll continue our discussion. Okay, so. Now here's the thing, right? That's actually Dr. Braun. He made this entire thing. Uh, what we gotta go find is old lady something. Simpsons. Uh, I'm trying to find Dithers. That's what I'm trying to find. But we gotta find the Dithers place. Henderson. 
I'm just trying to get out of here as fast as I can. I think I can just go Good straight day. to it, but I'm just going to go talk to her. That way you guys can have an idea. Right. Dithers. There we go. Old lady Dithers. Are you in here? Hey, you might be downstairs. Yeah. Looks like you are downstairs. Dithers. You. You don't belong here. You're not supposed to be here. It's not real. None of it. It needs to end. The suffering must end. Finally, someone knows what's going on. How do I get out of here? We're not really here. We're not really talking. It's all made up. Make believe. We're sleeping, dreaming. The dream became a nightmare. It has to end. It just has to. But we're not in charge. He is. And he doesn't want us to wake up. Who are you talking about? He calls himself Betty now, but he's still the same. He can put on a new face all he likes, but underneath he's still evil. Braun. Bastard thinks because he helped create this place, he's God here. But I know he still uses the failsafe terminal. I know it. What failsafe? What the hell are you talking about? It's in the abandoned house. He doesn't want us going in there because he's afraid we might find it. It's the only terminal to the outside. The only way to shut the whole thing down. You've got to find it. Okay. Alright, now we gotta go to... The abandoned... Place. Thing is, I don't know what it looks like. Is this it? Oh, cool, it's right here. Alright. Now I do have the things here. It's radio... Pitcher. Gnome. Pitcher. Cinder block. Gnome. And then bottle. Here we go. And this is how you can get out of here without even doing anything inside. Review documentation. Dr. Braun, here is the revised code for the military training program you, you've expressed interest in. I'm not sure exactly what you want with it, and I again stress that this program is, was never designed to be run with civilian equipment. Frankly, I don't expect any system you have access to even run it, but if you can run this program with the failsafes off as requested, your real-world test subjects will die if killed in the simulation. It goes without saying that officially I denied your request. General Constantine Chase. Okay, I did not mean to do that. Uh, access. Initiate. Proceed with caution. Gain good karma. Yep. We're gonna kill everybody, huh? Alright, where's Betty? Come here, Betty. I gotta talk to you. I got a bone to pick. Do you realize what you've done? You've triggered the failsafe, ruined everything. The subjects will die and I'll be stuck here in this hell alone. You ruined everything. Everything. I'm calling the shots now. <laughs> you? <laughs> no, I. I am the creator of this world. Feels so lost. So all alone. Tell me about the Gek. Came here from my father now, where is he? He's been right here the whole time. And you were too dense to figure it out. The dog, you see. Oh yeah, the dog is him. Man's best friend. But now you've taken all my friends from me. Okay, I gotta go. Run along now. Man, yeah, so he's literally, they're gonna kill everybody within this place. And then he's gonna be stuck in here forever alone. And we can just get out of here. That's the worst part of this game, in my opinion. I hated it. Can't stand it. Alright. Go ahead and put the combat armor back on. And... Oh, my helmet's broke, huh? Dang. Okay. Alright. Here, Dad. Son, you've saved me. I was afraid I'd be trapped in there forever. It's so good to see you, but... What are you doing here? I came here to find you. Well, 
I'm glad you did. This certainly wasn't how I expected things to turn out. I wasn't ready for brawn, or I might have fared better. Good thing I showed up to save you. It certainly is. It's nice to feel that I'm on two legs again. And thanks to Dr. Braun, I know that Project Purity isn't lost after all. What did you learn? I was right about Braun. The technology he developed is unstable, even dangerous. But it can be adapted for Project Purity. I need to return to Rivet City and talk with Madison. If we can find a Gek, we can make Project Purity work. You're going back to Rivet City now? Yes. With what I've learned, Madison is sure to see that we can finally succeed where we failed so many years ago. I'd like you to come with me. I'd like you to be there when we finally open the floodgates. Okay, let's head to Rivet City. That's my boy. Let's hurry. Now that I know what we need, I want to get back to work as soon as possible. All right. Go ahead and leave then. Be careful, my son. Hello, sir. All right, we can just follow him out, pretty much. And then we can just fast travel straight to Rivet City. Yeah, he's a freaking fast dude, isn't he? Jeez. I'm gonna beat him out though. Watch this. Bang. Oh my god, he just beat me to it. This man's on one. Alright. Alright, gonna leave this freaking Casey's garage. Empty. Should have got everything out of here. Alright, let's go ahead and fast travel to Rivet City. Yes. Alright, let's wait. Uh, let's go four hours. I would assume 8, 8 a.m. would probably be enough. They might want nine. Nope, eight's good. Nice. And then we'll just head back, talk to Dad and Madison, wherever, however we gotta talk to, and then we'll call an episode. Nothing stops the railroad. I'm just glad that that tranquility lane is over. I didn't think we'd be hitting that so early, but we did. There's actually a lot of stuff we could still can actually do in this game. I'm looking There's a few more main missions uh, as well, but... In terms of, uh... Side quests, there's a lot yet to do. And, like, places to explore and whatnot, so... Okay, who am I talking to? to Dr. Lee. What can I do for you? Can I play... What there we There he is. Go talk. Go, go, go. We're waiting. Talk it out. Do your thing. I told you it would work, Madison. And now I can prove it. James, you're back. And with good news. I was right about Braun and the Gek. If we can find one, we can adapt it to work with the purifiers. I'd like to believe you, James. I really would. This is all just so... so sudden. Madison, I'm telling you, this is real. I talked to Braun himself. He confirmed it. Don't you see? This is what we've been waiting for. I... I don't know, James. So many years have passed. Is it really still worth trying? How could it not be worth improving the lives of everyone in the Wasteland? What could be a more worthy endeavor? You haven't lost any of your passion, have you, James? It's as important to me as ever, Madison. I know it's important to you, too. Let's finish it together. James, I... We don't have a Gek. I can get a small team together, but we'll need proof that it works before people believe us. I know, I was thinking about that. The lab at the facility had some old pre-war computers that we scavenged. One of them might be useful. From the last reports, there's no power at the facility. Even if one of those computers had a database, we couldn't access it. That's why we're going to head over there right now and get things up and running as best we can. You know, if it were anyone else asking me to do this, I'd have them run right out of Rivet City. And you know I wouldn't be here if I didn't think this would really work. It's time. Get a room already. Damn you, James. Hey. When this is all over, you owe me a drink. Hey, sugar. Get out of here. Team together. Janice. Thank you, Madison. It's good to be working with you again. Is everything all right? I'm fine. We need to get back to Project Purity. The computer there is our best chance to locate a Gek. 
Uh, won't that be dangerous? All right, let's get going. That's my boy. It'll be good to work side by side with you, son. All right, let's do it then. Join the scientists at Project Purity. I'm just gonna go back the way that I know. Yes. It'd be so much easier for me instead of getting lost in this ship because it's kind of easy to do so. Go up this friggin' place. Go straight. Excuse me. Everything looks okay here. And then go up this way. Good to see you. And I guess we'll just go ahead and fast travel to Jefferson Memorial. Memorial. All right, guys. I think we're gonna call it right here. Ah, <sighs> Tranquility Lane is over with. I'm so glad that that's that's done. We got a lot of stuff to do yet, and. <clears throat> a lot of games to play yet, so if you guys are enjoying it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and show your friends. As always, guys, I'm Mr. Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode, the Fall 3 campaign. We got Mafia coming up, maybe part two, I'm not sure what's, like, what's going going on. I've been going back and forth for games, so yeah, see you guys soon. Bye.